Church music remains a big part of Richard Watts' life. 70 years ago, he was the youngest chorister in the Westminster Abbey Choir School. Aged just nine, he found himself singing at the Queen's coronation. The first time we sang was when the choir came in for singing, I was glad. This is the greeting of the Sovereign. And this is a huge sound. And the impact on myself as a nine-year-old, never having sung with an orchestra before, apart from once in the rehearsals, um, was a great, great event. And I remember that sound pretty much to this day because this was the start of the whole thing. And in a sense, after that start, we're on autopilot because we knew exactly what the script was, we knew exactly what music we had to do, and the only time we're let off the leash, I guess, is when we're singing God Save the Queen. Through Admiralty Arch comes the coach. After the ceremony, the Queen and Prince Philip went on a procession around central London. Tens of thousands of people packed the capital streets, trying to get a glimpse of the newly crowned monarch. 